Hello there, great people. Greetings from Portugal. My name is Nuno. Uh, today, Apple released the beta 5 of macOS Mojave. Today is 30th, the 30th of July. So I released a video um, a week ago regarding the, the bugs that were encountered on beta 4. So now we are going you know, through all the steps, you know, see the performance, see the new features and also if the bugs are not resolved okay so first let's see um, regarding this beta how much it is so we are looking at uh, 3.34 gigabytes on a mid 2015 macbook pro okay this was the amount that i had to download now regarding the the speed tests of my um, SSD okay it is uh, the same of the previous beta and also the same as Mac OS ICR so no issues whatsoever with the speed of the um, SSD regarding the Geekbench now in the Geekbench we are looking at a score that you know it's uh, at, on par with the previous betas in fact this multi-score uh, and also the single core are higher than i sierra okay so this is very good let's see and wait for further betas and if this in fact you know um translates in 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 performance in real usage okay guys now the build number for this for this uh, release of beta 5 10.14 mojave it's the 18a347e okay by the way for you to check the specs this is a mid 2015 15 inch 2.5 intel core i7 16 gig gigs of ram and the dual gaf graphics cards okay so the dedicated and the integrated the amd radeon r9 m3070 x with 2 gigs of ram and the, the integrated is the intel iris pro with one and a half gig okay so let's forget these numbers and let's go what uh, for me what it is important first of all it wasn't possible in the previous beta uh, and there were lots of comments and I appreciate all of you that put the comments of things that are working or not it depended on 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 from person to person and uh, I wasn't able to open um, a private window now you can okay so for you guys that depend on private browsing you are now uh, you this beta resolved the situation the beta 5 okay so perfect good news i had also the issue that was facetime and i have to test it all again with but for other reason but i wasn't able for uh, uh, the cameras it didn't recognize the cameras okay and uh, it was very very laggy uh, with the microphone and everything now we can see hi guys how are you <laughs> now i'm able to to see i'm using now a logitech c920 but if i want to change in the video i have all the options the eyesight camera from the monitor and the eyesight camera from the laptop okay so this is good it is working and it is good news uh, for me okay now one of the things that i will of course test is the ability it i already tested the ability to answer the calls on the mac in the previous beta i wasn't able uh, to um, to uh, sorry i forgot the term you know it's it's very it's a little bit late i already made two videos one on a iphone and the other on the ipad now to answer the calls sorry uh, guys i'm from portugal and sometimes the words in english skips me a little bit so to answer the calls on the mac okay sometimes it, they were a little bit difficult sometimes they work sometimes they didn't and also i just tested it is possible again 
to make the phone calls from the Mac. Okay, so now you can answer and can make the calls. If you had that issue in the previous beta, it is working, at least for me. Okay, if it didn't, it isn't, go ahead and put on the comments. Now, uh, there are new things uh, here that I already checked uh, and there are new wallpapers. Okay, this guys, this is the first look, of course, then we can make another video. But if we go for people that like wallpapers, there are a bunch of wallpapers now. So if we go through, the dynamic still remains, as you as you know, the, the Mojave, so the, the first one that they showed. And now you have, of course, lots of them. This is new, let me put this to the side, new new okay there are in fact good wallpapers I can, I can go through with you okay seems nice very nice nice wallpapers yeah as you can see I'll go through with you this is this is very nice very nice again okay uh, this one already new guys I don't remember this one so let me see but I will go through these perhaps are the new wallpapers for the new MacBook Pros the, the the 2018 ones so here you have now in this release new wallpapers again i suppose this one they are new and the only dynamic that still remains is the first one that was launched on the keynote and also this that we already saw on the previous build so guys lots and lots of wallpapers let me put here one that is nice yeah this is very nice uh, lots of uh, wallpapers uh, again uh, this I had a bug uh, now it is working again on the dynamic wallpapers if I go here to the, the dynamic one uh, I don't know if this will work or not but if I go again here to the dark mode to let me oh, sorry let me go here to general and if I go to bright let me go again yeah, it is, it is working again, because when I changed to the dark mode, even if it was during the day, the wallpaper changed. It is working now. So guys, uh, for now, this is what I can tell you. Ah, well, another thing that didn't work, it was Siri. Now, hey Siri, how are you? I'm as happy as Finder. Actually, no, no one's as happy as Finder. Okay, so Siri, it's working again. Siri, uh, tell me a joke. I just spent a day in one of those hyperbolic chambers. It was the absolute worst. Okay, so guys, if you trust on Siri on your Mac, it is working once again. It wasn't for me, now it is. Now, I have to test, of course, lots of things here. Uh, I have to test Final Cut. Uh, I had major issues with Final Cut. Uh, when I was transcoding and exporting the videos and I wanted to watch a YouTube video when I was waiting it was impossible uh, to watch so in nice area everything worked perfectly but in Mojave it was you know uh, <laughs> the computer was over the limits regarding uh, the the RAM usage guys I have 16 gigs uh, on this laptop I'm using with screen recording uh, I'm using 4 gigs, so very good, this seems pretty nice uh, with all these applications running, let's go ahead, open some of them um, let's go here to Spotify, let's go to music uh, I'll skip the, the others because they are, they are private, but you know, it seems to work pretty well, let's go to the App Store let's go to the App Store, so everything seems to work, I have to to uh, I don't have the password here okay sorry I have to blur that uh, so guys for now this is it a first look the bugs that I wanted to be fixed they are uh, I did launch the iPhone and the iPad uh, iOS 12 beta 5 already and I want to check in the Mac on the Mac uh, with all the ecosystem if it is possible on the iPhone to change, if I answer on the iPhone and I want to continue the conversation on my Mac or iPad, if it is possible or not. It wasn't on the previous beta, so uh, that's what I want to check. Of course, I will make a follow-up video. For now, my social links 
are over there. I will put uh, information about bugs that I can encounter on Twitter or Instagram, or, but more on Twitter. And uh, guys, for now this is all. Thank you very much for stopping by and watching the video. Put on the comments below any bugs if you are if you are upgrading, if you encounter any bugs, so I can go ahead and post them also on 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 the next video of the follow up. So, without further ado, guys, and not wasting more of your time, it's a long video. Thank you so much for watching, and I see you in the near future. Bye bye.